Ah, a new guerrilla. Be nice, horse. Hola, is this Yami? Found your number on a poster about racing. Oh, if you like racing, you call the right number. We do it guerrilla style. Each track is marked with checkpoint flares you gotta drive through. Try to beat the best time. You in? Fuck it. I'll try it. That's the racing spirit right there. I like you already. Suerte! Coño, this guy has a serious pest problem. I should take a look inside. So this is Alvaro's place. No sign of Alvaro. Or the mongoose. What was that? Sounds like it's coming from that shed. Your mongoose reign of terror is over. And thank you for the key.
lot to be done with this place. And mongooses. We are taking a lot of risks for one lieutenant. You want to complain? You can swim. <laughs> nice boat. Is it yours? No, I stole it. Papa taught me how to hotwire tractors when I was a kid. Boats aren't so different. Hey, we have to get Carlos a doctor. Luck. He's coughing blood. He needs help. Papa took me fishing once. South of Costa del Mar. He's a hell of a rancher, but a shit fisherman. No patience. Couldn't cast. Kept snagging his line on the bottom. Even hooked himself in the lip. <laughs> Got so pissed, he threw a stick of dynamite in the water. Killed a lot of fish, but also put a fucking hole in our boat. We swam five kilometers back to shore. All these boats stopped to help, but Papa told them to fuck off. What does this have to do with Carlos being sick? I'm saying that the day Carlos Montero gets help, is the day hell freezes over, Danny. Coño. You Monteros are stubborn. Not me. Just Papa. <laughs> sure. Sure. Shut up. Fucking tobacco. It was supposed to make our people rich. That's what Anton said anyway. See. Si. That's how we got elected. Yes, and a lot of us voted for him. We believed in his promises. We thought it was going to be like the old days again. Like some kind of fantasy. We were so fucking wrong. If we want to change things, someone has to whip us all into shape. Bring us together. And it's not going to be Papa. So Carlos doesn't have a plan? His plan is don't tell anybody what the fuck you're feeling, ever. Don't trust anybody either, especially your own daughter. Just fucking react to whatever Napoleon el Pequeño throws your way. He's old school. Reminds me of my headmaster in the orphanage. Strict, tough as shit, but if he liked you, he had your back for life. Hmm. That kind of thinking is gonna get us all killed. We can't keep reacting to Jose. It's not working. We need to try new things. Be agile. Stay one step ahead of that little hijo de puta until he's dead. I'm with you. Good answer, Danny. You smoking Mexican? Tobacco out here has been vivido. Can't even smoke our own anymore. Come and meet us. Shit. Que pas? Jose fucking Castillo. Anton's bitch of a nephew. Lo veo y no lo creo. What's he doing? He's, uh, he's... With the lieutenant we were looking for. Looks more like a scientist. Let's take Jose out. No, no. You might hit the lieutenant. What's going on? Fuck. Hey, over there. I need to know where that scientist is going. Let's search this place for intel. Let's go. Maybe his friend by the helipad can help. Of course. We were chosen by getting out of the 
I see a medic. This says Jose has a villa on the north side of the island. Think Jose's got a computer around here? Special forces.
to find intel on where that scientist went. No password, idiota. Let's see what we got here. El pequeño has a fucking chamber filled with outcasts. It's under the lighthouse here. Cojone. Can you let me in? Check it out, ahora!
Thank you. I can never yeah, repay you at all. No problem. Dios mío. Espada. Jose was using this place as his own little torture chamber. He had outcasts in there, but I freed them. Enfermo mental. I shouldn't be surprised. Good work, though, Danny. I found where that scientist works. The Singao we saw earlier. His lab's in Refmira. Meet me there. Okay. Then are you going to tell me what's really going on? You'll know when I need you to know. Oye, guerrilla. Let's go, horse. <gasps> Vamos. That's a good horse. Don't worry, I'm a friend.
So why do you want this guy so bad anyway? El come mierda checks all the tobacco leaves for the vivido process. We fuck up the leaves, we fuck up the cancer drugs, we fuck up Napoleon e Pequeño's operation. Make him look bad in front of old Uncle Anton. A lot of heat. So how you wanna do this? We kill soldiers until we find him. And then? And then we kill more soldiers. Simple. I like it. Papo! Can't hide from me. There's an engineer. Bulletproof alarm.
going back now. Get away from me! Ah, fuck me, mierda! Mierda is right. You look like shit, hermanito. Hermanito? We've been hunting your brother this whole time? Who the hell are you? Why didn't you just tell me? Alejandro, come on. We're going home. Vete pal carajo. Ale. Suéltame. Cojones. Pasa. ¿Qué es lo que te pasa? ¿Tú te fucks, Ale? I'm not going anywhere. I told you before, and I am telling you now. I believe in Castillo. I believe in Diviro and Jose. He's seen the vision through. Napoleon el Pequeño is a slave driver. He's fucking loco. <laughs> Says the person trying to kidnap me. You change your name. You change your uniform, but you are still a Montero. And Papa still got a machete up his ass. And you are running to the jungle like you did when you were five. Except now you kill people and you got yourself, what is it, the spike? The sword. Wow, clever. What? You are going to stab me now? Papa is sick. I don't care. Papa gave up on me a long time ago and you know it. Family's a bitch, no? That's what I hear. We should split up. Not a word about this to Papa. Hola. You good? Si. Sí. I never thanked you for helping me track down Ali. I wasn't exactly honest with you. All good. Just glad I know the real story now. I was worried you wouldn't help if you knew my brother was military. He's... a traitor. Si. Sí. But he's still family. Come back to camp soon. We got more work to do. Oye, guerrilla.